Anyone? Who was in the tree? Any Muslim? Can you unblock me? Yeah, Abbas, I, I, I will find you. I have 20,000 names in my Skype, my friend. Can you unblock me? Abbas wanna call me now, supposedly. Actually, Skype is not logging in. Answer me, Abbas. Here, we, when we, uh, you know, we get a chance to call you, I will call you. I'm trying to get in Skype. What is the answer? Was Allah in the tree, or yes or no? Say, just say yes or no. Was Allah in the tree? Let me force Skype to shut down so I can log in, maybe. It's possible because he, you know, he was acting like a kid before. I took many calls of him. He never answered anything. He is the mature between kids. This is who is Abbas. You will see. I will, I will, let, I will call him. But, you know, the, the good thing about Abbas, he is not filthy like the rest, you know. Like he says silly stuff, stupid stuff. <clears throat> okay, Abbas, let me try to find you. Abbas, where is Abbas? <clears throat> okay, hold on. And guys, if you see my uh, if you see my Skype, you will not believe it. Where is Abbas? Okay, Abbas. The name under Aga Abbas, uh, and you have a picture of um, uh, the Kaaba. All right. Okay. He call me using that name, my friend. Here we go. There's an, a name, it's called Aga Abbas. I guess this is you. Call me using that name. There's a picture of the Kaaba. I'm waiting for you. <coughs> we will hear Mr. Abbas in a second. <laughs> Abbas, call me. You are not blocked. We have another Muslim here calling. Let us see. Muhammad Rafi. Uh, he hang up. <coughs> Uh, Farouz is calling now. Okay, Farouz is getting strong now. Hey, Farouz. Hello. Hello, my friend. How are you? Hello. Hello, hello. Talk. Yeah, just like how are you didn't pick up my call. Well, we took your call first time. You did not answer, so we thought maybe you are joking. So, what do you want to say to us, Mr. Farouz? First, expose your lies, okay? Okay. You are using, you are using fake hadith. Which one is that fake is hadith? Why, which uh, one? Which one? No, which one is fake hadith? Please, if you if you don't mind, help me. Which one of the hadith I use? It was fake. Listen, listen to me first. I'm listening, uh, listening. No, no, I'm I listening, brother. I'm listening, brother. I'm listening. Which hadith I said it was fake because you just said something. You need to prove it. 
I'm giving you a chance to talk to me. You know, there's long line of Abdul. They want to call me too. So I need you, you to help me because maybe there's a fake hadith and maybe I do not know. And you are, you are the ustad, you are the sheikh, you are the one who knows. We do not know. We want to learn from you. So which hadith I showed in the screen was fake? I'm listening, listening to you. This is the problem. I'm listening to you, but you are not listening to me. Which hadith I showed in the screen was fake hadith. Otherwise, you have to apologize for being a liar. So either you show me the fake hadith I showed you, or you apologize, say, I am Abdullah from India. I have no idea what I'm talking about. I'm trying to copy Zakar Naik. Ibrat editor, great and print, he take fake hadith. And those hadith prove it to be wrong. Show me the fake hadith. Go ahead. Hmm. Which, which, hadith, which hadith is fake? Okay. Uh, first, let me uh, let me expose you. You are not even. You said you said no. Don't, you are. No. This is why. This is how we want you to expose us. You just said that. You said I'm using fake hadith. So tell me which hadith I use. It was fake. Let me expose you. I'm letting you expose me. That's why I'm asking you which hadith is fake. So all what you need to do, say this hadith you showed us on the screen is fake. Which one? Okay. So first, let me check. Uh, let you check. Hello. Hello, hello. Hello. Hello, 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 hello. Cairo here. Yeah, I'm trying. We hear you from Cairo, brother. Alhamdulillah, Ramadan, Kareem, brother. Okay, where is the fake hadith? What? Hello, hello. You said I showed the fake hadith in the screen. Which one is the fake hadith? Uh, yeah, about, about the uh, breastfeeding words. Okay, here we go. So finally, he said about, okay, let us see the breastfeeding uh, verse. Okay, let us see. Uh, okay, uh, what the hadith is saying? Remind us. Okay. Hmm. Uh, see, uh, first of all, uh, let me tell you that uh, the breastfeeding verse is for the orphan children. For children? Okay. Orphan, orphans. Okay, ah, for a children. Okay, for the, uh, okay. For, for, okay, well, for, here we go. This yeah. is the, this is the hadith. Okay, my friend, you are a very smart person. I will learn from you, and I, uh, I really am really honored to speak to someone with your knowledge. You have a very powerful knowledge. Here we go. This is the hadith of Sahih Muslim, and this is Sahih. Now I can show it to you from Sahih Bukhari, Sahih Muslim one four five three a. The Prophet said to the women, suckle him. She said. How I can suckle can I suckle him and he is a growing up man? See, this is uh, that that is what I told you uh, earlier. That this is a translation. Uh, it is not an. Arabic. No problem. Here we go. I will read for you in Arabic. Do you know Arabic? Read the Arabic. Forget about the translation. Translation is not true. Read the Arabic. By the way, translation made by you, Muslim. This is a Muslim website. This is Sunnah.com. So you are saying to me that you Muslim, you give false translation, shame on you, shame on you. I will call the Islamic police no, for I you. Think. I will ask Jibril to cut your tail for lying to, to us in the translation. Now read for me in Arabic, as long as you claim the translation is false. Read for us the Arabic, here we go, it's in front of you. You, you should be a joker, you should not debate. Can only read the Arabic for me, you claim that the translation is fake, here we go. The Arabic in the front of you. Read for me. I will highlight for you the line and you read it. Go ahead. Yeah, give me the reference of the reference. You said to me the translation is wrong. Do you know Arabic? Read it in Arabic. It says, let me read it for you. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. فقال النبي فقال النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم أرضعي فقالت وكيف أرضعه وهو رجل كبير. Do you know what رجل كبير mean? A growing up man. How I'm going to breastfeed him and he's a growing up man. Your prophet, he laughed at her when she said that. Look, she said, how I can suckle him and he's a growing up man. The messenger smiled and he said, I know, I know he's a growing up man. <laughs> so what you are saying to why, me, I'm lying. Why, why, why are you not showing me the reference? Are you scared or what? What do you mean show reference? I showed you Sahih, Sahih Muslim. The first thing I did, I said no, no, Sahih Muslim, hadith number no, 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 one, four, one, four, five, three, A. One, four, Sahih Muslim, one, four, five, three, A. Wait, let me check. Hmm. 
Check, check, brother. I will post the link for you, brother, in the in the in the chat, so you can open it from there. Open it there. Here we go. I just posted for you. Go ahead. Check it. Check it. Hmm. By the way, I like this hadith. I like uh, breastfeeding suckling. To be honest with you, uh, actually, I applied to convert to Islam uh, because I want to do breastfeeding for adult. I'm adult. I'm qualified for that. I have lips too, and I want to practice it every day. I mean, I will. I will. I will do I, not. I will do I, nothing I, in I life after know, that I, date. I will be. On, I will be honest. You are not a debater. You are a joker. Okay. Who is the joker? The joker is the one who said it's a fake hadith, and now you are running away. You are biting your tail, and you are running away from the accusation. Is it you who said to me this is you a fake it, hadith? Is, is it you? Is it you who said to me it's a fake hadith? So who is the joker? The joker is the one who ordered your mama to give her nipples to Usama. But Usama is not the son of the mama. He is the neighbor. Who is the joker? How Usama? How Usama will suck the nipple of your mama? Explain to me. Usama bin Laden in Pakistan, in Afghanistan, and now he been ordered by Allah Messenger to suck the nipple of your mama. Explain to me what's happening. Stop changing the topic and send me. I'm the not discussion. changing the topic. It's you who mentioned to me this hadith, guys. Isn't it him who said this is the hadith about breastfeeding for adults? It was only for kids. It's a fake hadith. I will expose your lies. And we choose. We, I am not the one who chose the topic. It was you. It, Abdul, it was you who chose it. It was you who chose this hadith, not me. Why you are now saying that you are changing the topic? Send me the reference on Skype. The reference is already there in the in the chat. Click in it. Here we go. It's in the chat. Everybody can see it, and we can give it to you from Sahih al Bukhari. We can give it from from any website, from any uh, uh, book you want. All of them they agree that this is Sahih, 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 and you said that this is fake. Shame on you. Why you are saying it's fake? Are you saying your prophet is fake too? But let me tell you what happened, my friend. Because you are ashamed of your prophet, so you decide to say, this is cannot be my prophet. It have to be fake. For if this is true, that means my prophet is a perverted no, no, no. man. No, listen, 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 listen. The reality is that there were, uh, this hadith is compiled by humans, right? It's not compiled by God. So we cannot... Compare by, by, compare what? By what, what, what? I don't understand. Hold on. I don't understand. Compare by what? Hadith is compiled by humans. Hey, the Quran is compiled by human too. Isn't it the Quran compiled by human? Who is Uthman? Is Uthman is God? No, no. Quran what? No, no, no. Who is the one? Who is the one who collect the Quran? The Quran itself describes itself as a Hadith. The Quran says the Quran is a Hadith, and this is Hadith. And here now we are saying that the one who collect the Hadith no. is a human. But who is the one who collect the Quran? No, no. You are, you are, you are a chukar. No problem. Okay, I'm a, okay, you can call me. You can call me all the names you want, but everybody is laughing at your prophet, not at me. Here we go. You are in the corner, and now you are the one who accused me that this is a fake hadith. And you said to me, "Show me the reference." We showed you the reference, and the reference even said this is Sahih. We showed it to you from Sahih Muslim. We showed it to you from Sahih Ibn Najah. So blah 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 blah. All Muslim agree is Sahih. Why you don't agree? Because you are ashamed of your prophet. Just face it. I'm not ashamed that uh, the fact. Okay, hold on, hold on. You know what? Hold on. I will change the topic just for your sake, just to help you. You are a proud Muslim. Can you prove to us? You see, we have 1,500 people watching right now. Can you show us one thing your prophet he said or did or the Quran? Prove to us that Muhammad is a prophet from God. Okay. Uh, see. Uh, uh, Muhammad followed the Abrahamic law, so uh, so it is so it proves that he is a prophet of God, right? Mm. Okay, is the Abrahamic law is to give a breastfeeding for adult? Is the Abrahamic law to have sex with Aisha at the age oh. of six? Is the Abrahamic listen, law? Listen, is the Abrahamic no, law is you to no, go? Is no, Abrahamic no, law you go no, to your no, wife's no, son no, and you flirt with her? Is the Abrahamic law you say that Allah He order you to commit sin of adultery as he, he, he you must commit because this is a destiny? Is that Abrahamic law to kiss a black stone? 
Is that Abrahamic law to go and, and, and to, to bow down in front of the stones see, and to see, go around the stone? See, see you are not, not, not even letting me speak. You are, no, I'm letting you speak. You are the one who say, I ask you, what is the proof that Muhammad is a prophet of God? You said to me, he is following Abraham, but Abraham did not do anything of those shameful stuff. The, most, most of the thing you mentioned, it is from Hadith is not from Quran. What do you mean it's from Quran? Quran? Okay, hold on. It's not from Quran. Okay, hold on. Guys, it's not from the Quran. Let me ask you. If I am claiming to be a prophet now, and I say, any woman she want to give herself for me to sleep with her, is that from God or from me? What do you think? No, no, no. no. I, I, I know this word. I saw this word in one of No the problem, no problem, Abdul. Listen, I want you to answer me. Be, be, be honest. I will, make a, I, will, I will make a statement saying, anyone she want to give herself to me. So I can sleep with her. Okay, is that from God or this is from me? Uh, listen, I saw this verse. Uh, uh, these, see, there were a lot of women. Uh -huh. who lost their husband on war okay no problem a lot of women right now a lot of women in iraq right now they lost their husband so i'm going to make a verse says any women from iraq from somalia from syria from america from canada who lost her husband come to my door this is my address knock three time if you have no panty knock it twice if you have panty knock once if you are ugly so i will not open the door i mean okay how that can be from god I, I already told you you're a joker. Whether you're joker, you're joker, joker. If they are a person who, they are women who, they are widows, he should help them, support them without sleeping with them. Are you saying to me now, Muhammad, he was doing this because he want to sleep with all the women who lost their husband? He have thousands of men, they lost their husbands. See, uh, sleeping sleeping with all the women is not only, uh, women also desire to sleep, right? So ah, okay, I get you now. So you are saying those Muslim women, they are very horny and they are very excited and the Prophet, he want to help them. Is it, it, it's, it's called a sex charity. <laughs> so Muhammad, he opened sex charity department. Any woman, she is, <clears throat> you know, hot. Uh, you know, you have a heat. So come to the Prophet, knock at his door and the Prophet will do boom, boom with you. And this is only a privilege for the Prophet. Is that correct? So see what? Uh, see what? Um, Why Allah He gave Muhammad the privilege is about about his penis. What kind of a privilege? Only the Prophet have the privilege. What about the Muslims? Why Allah did not say any woman she wanna give herself to Abdul like you? He can have sex with her. You just say there's many women they lost their husband. So Muslim they can do that too. They can help in the mission. Why this privilege is only for the Prophet penis? They were not forced to do that. Women had their choice to sleep with the prophet. So, uh, my friend, I, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Who, who is talking about about forcing or not? We are talking about what kind of a prophet he make verses privilege about his penis, saying any woman she can can give herself. What does that mean? The guy he have already thirteen wives. Why he need more women to offer themselves in the bed? What's wrong? This guy, he have no time to pray. He have no time to, to go in war. He have no time, but he have time. He have time to do boom, boom. Any woman she want to give herself. Why? What does this have to do with God? I already told you they lost their husband and they wanted to have a relationship okay. with men. Okay, if this is about the husband is die, if this is about the husband is dead, then the prophet should make a verse for all Muslims. They can do that, not only him, but this was only a privilege to thee. Why it is a privilege only for Muhammad? Can Muhammad sleep? Okay, now we have more than a million women. They are widows in Iraq. Are you saying the prophet, if he was there, he only is the one who can sleep with all those a million women. Is that possible? How many men they lost their life during the time of Muhammad, killing his enemies, going in war? Muhammad, you are saying to me that Muhammad made a verse saying See, any woman no, no, she no, want to sleep listen, with the prophet. No, no, listen, listen. Mm, listen, no, listen. No, listen to me. You are making it like he uh, did some uh, something like terrorism. No. He fought for the uh, he, he fought for God, you know. He wanted to establish two religion and all uh, because there was a lot of uh, pagan belief mm. uh, during the prophet's life. 
and he wanted them to follow the true god the abrahamic faith so he uh, fought with them you know the pagans used to sacrifice their children and all like that. you must so have you sacrificed children too the, you uh, muslim you muslim you sacrifice children don't you who said you sacrifice children okay uh, if i show you the hadith what you will say i have a daif hadith Da'if hadith, what you will say? You will not accept it, right? You will say it's Da'if hadith. No, no, it is not. See, thing is that uh, the hadith is compiled by humans. Hmm. Quran is a so now, be, be, okay. Is a... So now, because it's compared by a human, so we don't, we don't accept it, right? No, no. See, you are twisting my word. I'm not saying we, we should not accept. It. I'm saying hmm. okay. we should. Accept it if it uh, matches with the Quran. Okay, well, here we go. Okay, actually, it's not a hadith, it's a Quran. Chapter 18, verse number 74. Your God, He ordered Prophet Al Khadr to slay, to slay a boy so he can be happy. Read it. And he is a Muslim boy. He is a Muslim boy. This is Quran. What now. is the point of this? And I'm not, I'm not getting it. Read it. Chapter 18, verse number 74. This is a Muslim boy, his parents are Muslim family, and he is just little a child. And the Prophet of Al-Khadr, he, he, he did the order of Allah by, by, by smashing his head in the wall, and slashing his head by a knife, and play billy ball with it. This is Quran now, what we will do? We will reject the Quran now? See what? See some I think I remember this verse. No, no, listen, listen. Ah, okay, I'm listening. Uh, I remember this verse. You remember it? Boy will grow up and he will become a non-Muslim and he will kill the Muslim. Okay. I think. Oh, yeah. he when when he grow up, he will become non-Muslim and he will kill the Muslim. Show me where it says he will kill the Muslim. Show me where it says that. Either you apologize for lying, or you apologize for lying because nowhere it says that this guy will grow up. And became not a Muslim to kill Muslim. It says that he is the fear he might be a disbeliever. He fear he did not become a Muslim, not Muslim yet, and he did not kill anyone. And nowhere it says he will kill somebody. Show me where it says that. No, uh, the thing is that non-believers used to attack the Muslim, so they are trying to defend themselves. So. Abdul, uh, what, I, what Muslim I, defend I, I, himself? I, 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 this guy I, 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 is walking. To, hold on. Hiss, 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 hiss. This is not war. This guy is walking in a village. There's nobody war. There's no army. There's a kid praying with the poly ball with, his, uh, with the children his age. And then Al Khadr, he cut him and he slaughtered him and he cut his head and then he starts smashing his head with the wall. What war? This is a kid. And he's a Muslim. So why you sacrifice a Muslim a child? And the excuse is you fear when he grow, he will be not a good Muslim. That's mean we need to kill all the bad Muslims before they grow. According to the Quran. And that would be stupid. There's millions and millions of Muslims today. They don't believe in Allah. They don't practice Islam. So now what we what you are saying to me, we in Islam, we have to kill them when they are children, and that is a children's sacrifice. Why you want to kill them? They are your, your children. These are not the children of the enemy in the war. Those are your children. See, that if, we, if we kill those children, before they grow up, non-muslim mm. they will go they will go they might go to heaven right my friend hold on they are muslim this is a, isn't it your prophet who says everyone is born as a muslim even a christian child what's wrong with you so he, he is a muslim already and he is a, a child of believers read the read the quran you know the quran you claim that you know the, the 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 story read carefully it says as for the boy his parents were believers what believers mean they were muslims and we apprehended that he might impose upon that, uh, 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 like in the time, he will, he will be not, not a good person. He will be infidel. So how you kill a child just because maybe when he grow up, he will be bad. Isn't it you Muslim you say, we should not, Allah will not judge you except by your sin. Where is the sin he did? He did not do anything. Even, no. even no. Moses, he, he says, even Musa, he no, said no, to Al Khadr. No, 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 even no, no, Musa no, no, said to Al Khadr, no, 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 "You killed, you slain." Hold on. Musa said, "Hold, 
موسى السيد هاست ذو سلين ا بيرسون اونسنت No problem. You can call me any name you want, but you cannot answer. This person is called, described by Musa. He is an innocent child. Read it. So why he killed him? He did no. not commit any crime yet. Did he commit any crime, this child? Listen, listen. listen. Hmm. Uh, this, uh, let, uh, let's, let's say this child will grow up and he will become a non-Muslim, right? Okay. And, yeah. And if and after becoming non-Muslim, after he died, then he will go to hell, right? Okay. So, if he, if we kill him while he was a child, uh -huh. then he may he he, he might go to heaven. Ah, right? so we killed him, guys. This is Islamic solution. We will kill our children, so they will go to heaven. You see the intelligence, super intelligent. So your dad, he should kill you when you are six years old. So you can go to heaven, Abdul, because now you are not sure you will go to heaven or not. Have you ever heard of a stupid like this? Secondly, hold on. Secondly, stupid Abdul. Listen, Abdul, listen. You, you have no idea you are talking to. You are talking to Christian Prince. Wherever you go, I will grab you from your tail. Isn't it your prophet? He says, even infant, he might go to hell. Yes or no? Yeah, I saw that word, but it was in hadith. Go to hadith. It says, Aisha, she said, Oh, this is a happiness for this child. He is a, he's, a, he's a child of a Muslim family. He will be a bird amongst the birds of paradise. The Prophet said to her, Be an adventure, Aisha. Don't be stupid. It might be the other way. So what you are saying to me, if we kill him as a child, he will go to heaven when it's not guaranteed. The hadith is in front of you. You are bringing me hadith, and I already told you that it is compiled by humans, so we cannot trust it. You cannot trust it? No, we we can uh, see. So why you call it? So why uh, you call it sahih? If it's not trustworthy, why you Muslim you call it sahih? So this hadith is fake, and you Muslim you call it sahih. That that is what I told you earlier. Mm, what you told that, me? Uh, What you told me? What you yeah, told me? Re remind me. I am not. Uh, you should, you should. No, 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 no. Tell me. I, I, I forgot what you told me. Remind me, please. Please remind me. What? You're a prophet. Made it clear. You're a prophet. Made it clear. Secondly, secondly, do you have the right to kill a child who is a Muslim child before he commit a crime? Isn't it, this is against the teaching of Islam to kill a child he did not commit a crime yet? I thought that Allah He made an order to kill the one who killed, especially in the case of murder. The guy he did not do anything. How you punish him for not doing anything yet? He did not do anything yet. He's just a kid. If we go to the interpretation for the verse, you will see it says it clearly. Hold on. Listen. Up, up, uh, 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 hold on. Oh, no, no. I'm asking you. How you can kill somebody, how you can punish somebody for a crime he did not commit. The mic is yours. First, give me the words. I will look it up. What? Give me the words. So all this time you are discussing with me, you do not know what verse we are talking about? Aren't you the one who told me? I know the verse? No, I, actually you are trying to twist some, something from so I want to make sure that you are not lying. Uh, I have it in the screen, chapter 18, verse number 71. And read verse number 71 and 72. Wait, wait, wait. Mm, waiting, waiting, waiting. By the way, you can call all the friends from Pakistan with you or from India. Call them, let them help you. Zakir Naik, he can help you. Let me call Zakir Naik until you read the verse. They take your time, no problem. Christian Prince, don't call me. Uh, uh, Zakir Naik, I have a, a Muslim from India. This guy, his wife, she's beating him now. What happened? He, he, he's saying that the child he was killed. What's happening there? This guy is in the zucchini, zucchini there. Let, 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 me, let me see. It. What? You let me what? Did you find the answer? See, uh, as I can see, you try to teach some words. Hmm, like what? Uh, what words which, which, which we twisted? 
so they they knew that he might become a non muslim hmm. and so so what if you if yeah. you want you you you're muslim you, you you keep saying to us there's no conclusion in religion yeah, you, the prophet he said hold on hold on hold on just to show you just to show you how you muslim you lie to us okay let me ask you if somebody leave islam should you, if if somebody leave islam if somebody leave is if somebody leave islam if somebody leave islam shall you kill him i knew you're trying to twist the word so i expose him how you expose me? People are laughing. Where you expose me? <laughs> Where? You just said he is going to leave Islam. So what? And how do you know he will leave Islam? Secondly, shouldn't you punish him after he do the crime? And in the top of that, ain't you Muslim? You keep quoting for us the Quran saying there's no conclusion in religion. So now because this child he will leave Islam, you kill him even if he's a child? No, no, you, you, you have been exposed. Let, let me prove you how you have, you have been exposed, right? Okay, go ahead. First go ahead. you said that child has not committed any crime right mm -hmm. so yeah so i i already told uh, i as, as i have read the source it 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 tells that the child will become muslim non muslim mm -hmm. and after after you know you know non muslim used to uh, uh, kill muslims and mm -hmm. all so muslim uh -huh. yeah uh -huh. Okay. Uh, no. uh, oh, 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 hold on, hold on. So this child, he is a child of a Muslim family. Then in the future, he will become not a Muslim. And then after he become a Muslim, he will kill his mama. This is what you are saying to me, right? He will kill his mama. No, no. What? No, no, no. What? No, 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 no. His parents are Muslims. His parents is Muslim. He's born of a Muslim family. He's a Muslim child. And now the child, even Musa, he said he is innocent. He did nothing. Read it. Musa said to him. You slain, you slain a boy who commit nothing. Why you killed him? Why you slain a person who is innocent? He's innocent. So what kind of religion you are killing a child of your own and he is innocent? And the excuse is maybe, maybe, even the verse says maybe, maybe when he grow up, he will be not no, a Muslim. Listen, listen. Listen, listen. No, 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 listen. Uh, you already know that non muslim used to persecute Muslims, right? Abdul, what Muslim, what about you, Muslim? This guy is a child in a village and he is in a Muslim no. village and no, the no, parents no, no. are Muslims first, 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 and now he is a playing he is a playing with his football he is a playing in his football so imagine hold on imagine you have a child and he is a playing with the football in the front of your house and then a guy his name is Al-Khadr he walked by he grabbed your child he grabbed your child he cut his head and then he started smashing his head on the wall justify that for me What, what I am trying to say is, uh, see, non-Muslims non used to persecute Muslims. Do you agree with me or not? Who? Hello. Hello, hello. Muslims used to persecute Muslims. Do you agree with me or not? The Muslim used to what? Non-Muslims used to persecute Muslims. Do you agree with me or not? Non-Muslim used to consider Muslim? What do you mean consider? Non-Muslim. Non non-muslims used to persecute muslims oh well, the muslim they used to persecute non-muslim too the muslims it's about who is stronger muhammad himself he did torture non-muslims he stole their money he raped their wife he took their caravan and he became the biggest gang in history so if you are saying that they did persecute you well here we go the follower of jesus he have a 12 of them all of them they've been slaughtered killed but they did not kill anyone so what Christians are persecuted until now in Pakistan, in India, and everywhere. Do we go after Muslim and we kill them? We don't. So what you are saying is a false excuse. Now we go back. This is a boy. He did not persecute anyone. He is born of a Muslim family. Give me a reason to kill him. See, si. si, senor. You knew that he, he, he will become non-Muslim, and after becoming non-Muslim, first of all, first of all, first of all, you are a liar like your prophet. Nowhere it says he will become not a Muslim. It says we fear, we fear he might. Does it say that? Read it. Read, read, read the translation. Read I, verse. No, no. Read verse number no, no. eight. Oh, no, 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 Abdul. 
my fingers i have my five fingers over your or over the bum of your prophet and now they are over your bum show me where it says he left islam it says we fear he might he might <laughs> read it it says it says he, he might leave islam <laughs> if you don't like the translation we can change it for you what translation you like it says he might we fear we fear he might leave islam he did not leave islam and he is not sure so now i can go to your house and kill your child and i say to you oh i fear he might leave islam <laughs> read carefully read carefully verse number 80 chapter number 18 says as for the youth his parent shut up shut up shut up shut up where people of faith and we feared we feared he would grieve them and abstain rebellion Do you see but he did not leave islam he, we fear, we fear, we feared, we feared. Do you know what we feared? The guy is guessing how in the world that can be from God. So now I can say, I fear that you, your child, will be a bad Muslim, so I kill him. Oh. Are you saying to me, are you uh, saying to me, you, if a Muslim you, now... Can you, can, you, be, can, you, can you give me one minute? Can you give me one minute? Where do you want to go? Where do you want to go? Uh, mute the audio. Why are you mute hello? hello? Where are you going? No, what? no, I'm... I'm uh, I, I need to drink water, so give me one minute. One oh, you minute. need to drink water? Water, hold on. Well, you're not allowed to drink water. It's Ramadan. What's wrong with you? Hello? Hello. One, one minute, one minute. Where, where are you going? So first of all, you have to drink camera urine. Not, uh, you know, aren't you following the Prophet Sunnah? Why, why are you uh, water? What's happened to the camera urine? He's not drinking water, he's talking, you see, ah. talking to himself. Google, or, Google. Oh, he's asking his friend to Google, 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 Google. He said to me he would drink water, but he's Googling. Look, do you hear it? Google, Google, Google. Sunnah.com. Google. You see, he told me he won't drink water. The liar, you see, he muted me now. Supposedly, I don't, he don't hear me. And he think we don't hear him. Stupid. He said he will go to drink water. But he is asking uh, somebody next to him. <laughs> you want to drink water? Google, Google. Let us, may, may Allah help us with Google. Okay. Uh -huh. I want to drink water. Huh? I want to drink water. Mm -hmm. All of this is drinking water, by the way. I mean, do you hear the water? This is water, I understand, by the way. When they say, I want to drink water, it means going to Google, go, search for FC, or ah, this is go. This is water. I want to drink water. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hello? Hello? Uh, hello, did you drink water, my friend? Did you drink water? See, listen. Did you drink your water? Did you drink uh, your water? I wanna, no, I want to be sure that you drank your water. Are you okay? See, don't check the topic. Did you drink, did, did, you, did you drink water? Did you drink water? Yes or no? You said you would go to drink water. Did you drink water? Yes, I drink water. You are a fraud uh, and you are a liar. Yes. We were hearing you, you idiot. You did not go to drink water. You were talking to the guy next to you, asking him to search Google, open tafsir, open snow.com. Why you lie? You said you, yes, I drink water. This is how Muslim they are. This is how decent the Muslims are. We were hearing every word you were saying. You did not leave and you did not drink water and you were talking to the guy next to you. Why you are lying? See, listen, uh, the, uh, what, what See, senor. See, senor, you are you are a fraud like your prophet. Why you lie to us saying you want to drink water when the fact you are trying to search Google, asking your friend next to you to open tafsir.com and hadith.com. Shut up. To the topic, right? No, I'm not to the topic. It's you who told me I want, I want to go and drink water. Why you lie to us? You did not drink water. See, see this, this thing has nothing to do with your topic, right? So why are you...